Tesla's 2025 Model Y, part of the much-anticipated Project Juniper, is turning out to be a major update to one of the most popular electric SUVs on the market. This refresh isn't just about minor tweaks, it's a blend of new design elements, advanced technology, and improved performance that will likely keep Tesla ahead in the competitive EV space. Let's dive into the new changes coming to the Tesla Juniper 2025 Model Y. Starting with the outside, the 2025 Model Y will boast a sleeker, more aerodynamic look. Tesla's designers are updating the front and rear sections of the SUV, making it more visually striking while also improving efficiency. The new LED headlights are sharper and more modern, while the back will feature a bold taillight bar that stretches across the vehicle, giving it a high-tech vibe. These updates fit perfectly with Tesla's minimalist style, Rumor has it there will also be a new red paint option that will add a vibrant, eye-catching touch for drivers looking to stand out. The interior of the Model Y will see just as much attention. Tesla plans to make the cabin feel more luxurious, with ventilated seats being one of the highlights. These seats, made with either perforated leather or other premium materials, aim to enhance comfort for long drives. If you're a fan of techie features, you'll love the new adjustable ambient lighting system. It offers hundreds of color options so passengers can create whatever mood suits them best. Meanwhile, the performance variant will emphasize sportier seats to match its more dynamic driving style. Tech lovers are in for a treat. The 2025 Model Y will have a rear seat touchscreen for passengers, giving them control over climate settings and access to entertainment on the go. This 8-inch screen is designed to make the ride more enjoyable for everyone, especially on long trips. Designed for passenger convenience, it gives those in the back seats control over climate settings, allowing them to adjust the temperature and airflow without relying on the driver or front seat controls. It also provides access to entertainment options, making long trips more engaging and comfortable. Whether passengers are streaming their favorite shows or playing games, this feature makes the Model Y feel less like a car and more like a moving entertainment hub. Tesla has always pushed boundaries when it comes to in-car technology. The introduction of a rear seat screen builds on their history of using touch screens to redefine vehicle interiors. Back in 2012, when Tesla launched the Model S, they shook up the industry with a massive 17-inch center display. This screen consolidated multiple functions like navigation, media, and climate control into one sleek, intuitive interface. At the time, this was a revolutionary departure from the cluttered dashboards of traditional cars, which relied on physical buttons and knobs. Tesla's approach set a new standard, influencing countless automakers to follow suit. The rear seat touchscreen in the 2025 Model Y continues this legacy of innovation by extending functionality to passengers beyond the front row. Historically, rear seat entertainment systems in cars have been bulky, often involving DVD players and flip-down screens. Tesla's approach is different. By integrating a sleek touchscreen interface that blends seamlessly into the interior, they maintain their commitment to minimalist design while adding substantial value for passengers. The front of the car will also see groundbreaking changes. Tesla is rumored to introduce steer-by-wire technology in the Model Y, which could redefine how drivers interact with their vehicles. To understand the significance of this feature, it's important to look back at the history of steering systems. Traditional steering relies on a mechanical connection between the steering wheel and the wheels of the car, usually through a system of gears, shafts, and rods. While effective, this setup has its limitations, especially when it comes to weight, flexibility in design, and adaptability to different driving conditions. In the 90s, 90s automakers began experimenting with electronic power steering, which uses sensors and motors to assist the driver without relying solely on mechanical effort. This technology made steering smoother and more efficient, paving the way for future advancements like steer-by-wire. Steer-by-wire takes things a step further by eliminating the mechanical connection entirely. Instead of a physical link, it uses electronic signals to control the car's steering system. When the driver turns the steering wheel, sensors detect the motion and send the information to an electronic control unit. 
which then directs motors to adjust the wheels. This system offers several advantages. For one, it allows automakers to design more flexible cabin layouts since they're no longer constrained by the need for a physical steering column. Steer-by-wire can also be fine-tuned to adapt to different driving conditions. For instance, the steering response can be made more sensitive at low speeds for easier parking and more stable at high speeds for better highway control. Another benefit is reduced vibrations. Traditional steering systems often transmit road vibrations to the steering wheel, which can be uncomfortable for drivers. Steer-by-wire eliminates this issue, providing a smoother and quieter driving experience. It also pairs seamlessly with autonomous driving technologies as the absence of a mechanical link makes it easier for the car's computer systems to take control when needed. Tesla's potential implementation of steer-by-wire in the 2025 Model Y is a bold move that aligns with its reputation for embracing futuristic technologies. While the system has been used in some high-end vehicles like the Infiniti Q50, its adoption by Tesla could bring it into the mainstream. If successful, it could set a new benchmark for steering systems in electric vehicles and beyond. This innovation isn't just about making driving easier, it's about rethinking what driving means in the first place. With steer-by-wire, the feel of the car can be customized based on driver preferences creating a more personalized experience. For example, a driver could choose a sporty, responsive feel for spirited drives or a smoother, more relaxed setting for long commutes. Tesla's use of over-the-air updates also means that the system can be continuously improved, introducing new features and refinements over time. Please hit the subscribe button to get updates like this one. Let's continue. Performance upgrades are also part of the plan. Tesla is expected to fit the new Model Y with a 96 kilowatt hour battery pack, giving it an estimated range of up to 500 miles under ideal conditions. That's a big step forward for long distance travel and will likely appeal to anyone who's ever worried about running out of charge on the highway. Tesla is also working on making the Model Y even more energy efficient by improving aerodynamics and overall design. Another standout feature will be the adaptive air suspension system. This system adjusts the car's height automatically based on the road conditions, ensuring a smoother and more comfortable ride. Whether you're driving on a bumpy city street or a rugged trail, the suspension will adapt to give you the best experience possible. Combined with Tesla's usual attention to handling and stability, these changes are sure to make the 2025 Model Y feel even better to drive. Tesla hasn't forgotten its commitment to autonomous driving either. The full self-driving system will still be available as an option, allowing for near-complete automation in many situations, such as highway driving or navigating through city streets. Over-the-air updates will continue to improve the system's AI, cameras, and sensors, making the car safer and smarter over time. Even without FSD standard, standard safety features like emergency braking and adaptive cruise control will come included, ensuring peace of mind for drivers and their families. Production of the updated Model Y is set to begin in Tesla's Shanghai factory by late 2024, with the car expected to hit the market in early 2025. China will likely be the first to see the new model, followed by other regions. Tesla's global supply chain strategy suggests they're aiming to make this new Model Y as widely available as possible. Please don't forget to subscribe. Pricing is always an important factor, and the 2025 Model Y is expected to start just above $45,000 for the base model. That's a competitive price when you consider the advanced features Tesla offers. Higher trims, like the long-range and performance versions, will cost more, but they come with added benefits like extended driving range, better acceleration, and more luxurious options. The performance trim is aimed at drivers who want a sportier experience. It's likely to include features like upgraded seats, a more powerful motor, and aerodynamic improvements. These enhancements will make it perfect for those who enjoy spirited driving, though the price will reflect the extra engineering and tech involved. 
When stacked up against competitors like the Ford Mustang Mach-E, Hyundai Ioniq 5, and Kia EV6, Tesla holds its ground. The Mustang Mach-E starts at around $42,000, but can go much higher for premium versions like the GT. Similarly, the Hyundai Ioniq 5 and Kia EV6 offer entry prices in the low $40,000 range, but can exceed $50,000 for all-wheel drive or high-performance models. Tesla's edge often lies in its technology and the expansive supercharger network, which is a significant selling point for many EV buyers. The financial appeal of the Model Y doesn't end with its purchase price. Tesla's efficiency in battery technology keeps running costs low, and many buyers in the U.S. can benefit from federal and state incentives. The federal EV tax credit of up to $7,500, for instance, significantly reduces the effective price. This credit was reinstated and updated under the Inflation Reduction Act of 2022, designed to encourage the adoption of electric vehicles and reduce environmental impact. To qualify for the federal tax credit, buyers need to meet certain criteria, such as an income cap of $150,000 for individuals or $300,000 for joint filers. The vehicle must also meet Made in America standards, which the Model Y does thanks to its final assembly location in the U.S. On top of the federal credit, states like California, Colorado, and New Jersey offer additional rebates, ranging from $2,000 to $5,000, making the Model Y even more affordable. The long-term savings are another big draw for Tesla owners. Electric vehicles have fewer moving parts than traditional gas-powered cars, which translates to lower maintenance costs. Plus, electricity is usually much cheaper than gasoline, especially if you charge your car at home during off-peak hours. Tesla's supercharger network also offers competitive rates, adding to the convenience and cost-effectiveness. However, it's important to note that the federal tax credit is applied during tax filing, not at the time of purchase. Buyers need to ensure they have enough tax liability to take full advantage of the $7,500 credit. Tesla helps customers understand how to make the most of these incentives, often providing clear guidance during the purchasing process. Tesla's focus on combining affordability with cutting-edge features is what keeps the Model Y at the top of its game. While competitors are improving their offerings, Tesla's reputation for innovation, performance, and an unmatched charging network ensures it remains a top choice for electric V buyers.